got some more fishing planet for you guys here again today and we are doing maroon river exploration one we've done lots of different missions across fishing planet on all different lakes you can check all across the channel so this is the mission that we are doing here now i have we have to travel to maroon river which i am here and then we have to catch the red fallied piranha which i've already caught but i will catch that again to show you how to do it we're going to click track the mission you don't actually have to track the mission to do the mission but i just track it just that way it shows up on screen for you guys so i'm heading down here to start off with i'm going to get set up and then um we'll bring you guys back when we get our fish but just before we do i need to go get my rod stand i messed up <laughs> okay i'm in a random room you guys will probably find me in a random room most of the time i do fish in random rooms majority of it just because I like to see what other people catch. You are also welcome to add me on Fishing Planet. Don't forget to subscribe, turn notifications on, drop a like on this video if it did help you out as well. Now, the reason why I always say subscribe, turn notifications on, because otherwise, when those new updates come out, you guys are going to miss it. And I try and show those updates as quick as I possibly can. As soon as this Maroon River was available, I started live streaming instantly, straight away. I got set up and I started live streaming about 30 minutes after, so I was actually a little bit late, if anything, and that was because I was, there was an update that came, there was, it didn't actually tell us about the update was coming, and I just got on with it, started fishing, and um, there was an update, wasn't sure what the update was about, and ended up coming across um, the, the, the uh, oh gosh, I forgot the name, the DLC, yeah, wow, I really forgot about that, yeah, forgot about the DLC, the DLC popped up on screen and that ended up being the update didn't realize it was actually for this for this new place but it's awesome i've been having great fun fishing here they still got the real drag which is a bit of a pain but hey other than that we're catching a lot of fish like there's lots of hot spots which we're going to show how to catch certain fish there's going to be lots of different things that you can find across the channel if you guys need it so i'm using the meat chunk in hope to try and get that piranha let's see what we have here Let's see if this is the fish that we need. So the semolina balls I'm using to try and catch the Oscar, which we ended up catching the spotted one. But we needed that anyway, so that worked out pretty good. So that's one of the fish that we need. So we can get it from here, this location. I will show you on the map, even though we showed you before. This is whereabouts we are. And I'm just casting, as you saw, literally just in front of me. I'm not casting very far out at all to get this. So this exploration seems like it's going to be pretty easy because you haven't actually got to catch too many fish for this one. Let's see if this is another fish. I haven't yet made any cuts or edits into this one. And there's the Oscar that we needed. Perfect. So tail barrac red tail barracuda we're after now. Now a good little tip just to tell you guys, as well as seeing, seeing this video, you can also go through here, click on the fish, and it will tell you what sort of things it actually prefers. Now, I don't think I've got any of that bait on me. Um, let's have a look. If not, we can always use other bait in replace for that. Let's have a look. Do I have that? Oh, okay, so I do have that. Perfect. All right. So we're going to drop that on there. Um, the float rod. I've tried using the float rod in this place. I haven't had much luck with the float rod at all, if I'm honest. So the piranha, you can also... It doesn't have to be meat chunks. You can also catch that on shiners as well shiners has worked for me let's oh okay we got a fish on here i think okay now strike done too early but that's fine because i don't want to use that i want to change over and put this bait on always look at what type of hook i'm using for what fish i'm catching as well that's a good little tip sometimes i forget to mention the hook so which i did for the them other couple of fish <laughs> but yeah keep an eye on what hook i'm using for what fish i'm getting that will help you out okay so that one for there that's perfect so to do this exploration one you don't really need heavy heavy duty rods as you can see it's working pretty pretty good me using catching these fish they're only small they're not that big but it seems like for the red tail barracuda it is going to take a little short minute and for the piranha it looks like it is going to take a little bit longer so with the piranha you can also use spinning using swim baits also works i've noticed using the swim bait hash five i'm just giving you different options of what you can use hopefully with a bit of luck i can make this video all as one without making any cuts or edits i could be lucky let's find out Let's see if this is what we need. 
Okay, so this is on the red worms. So as you can see, you can catch that fish, which again was a fish that we needed, but we've already got that. You can catch that. Let's see what this one is, meat chunks. Hopefully this one's our piranha. Looks like it is. So we can catch all the fish here at the same spot so far. There you go, there's the piranha that we already caught that I needed to show you. So that's the hash four with the meat chunks. That is an X series hook, it doesn't have to be X series, it can just be the normal hash four slash zero. I recommend using barbless hooks. If you use barbless hooks, you can also catch the Oscar by using that bait as well, so that's pretty good. Yeah, by using barbless hooks, you will get extra, 10% extra XP. So if you're after XP, which is what we're really after right now, and then I recommend to use that definitely let's change over that bait as well because now we only need that one fish and for that one fish we can use uh, it also said prawns as well didn't it so let's put some shrimps on there just on the odd case it might end up taking that that's what I do sometimes if I can't figure out what bait to use very important to look at this fish species so for the, um, that's for the wrong one, hold on, there you go, red tail barracuda, so that's centipedes as well, and freshwater prawns, I don't think I have any centipedes on me, I'll have a quick look, hold on, let's see, centipedes, I don't, I don't have any, Hmm, it might be possible to buy it from the shop though, let's have a look. No, it doesn't. Okay. Well, that's okay. I'm pretty sure we will catch it. This one is probably going to be the one that takes longest to catch, if I'm honest. Let's put on a one hook on there. So I'm going to try, I'm going to stay at this location, I'm going to try the, my best to try and hopefully catch it here at this location. If I can't, and then last result, I will have to move. If I do have to move, I will bring you guys back to show you that. But um, hopefully we manage to get it here so we don't have to move around. Sometimes when doing these missions, we do have to move around a little bit. We do use face cam and mic when I live stream. Anytime I make videos like this, I just hit record. I just use the mic. I don't bother setting up the cam just for anybody who's interested in that. So I'll bring you guys back for the last one in just a sec. Moved to so many different locations. Absolutely unbelievable. I will show you whereabouts we are, so don't worry about that. But at long last, we finally found the red tail barracuda. You would not believe how hard this has been to just get this one little fish. <laughs> half a pound or less than half a pound. All right, we will show you on the map. Give me one sec on the map exactly we're about to record it but there we go maroon river exploration has been complete i told you that one would be difficult and it is very very difficult if you don't know where to look but i managed to spend a good amount of time hours <laughs> all right i spent hours finding that fish so i hope this one does help you out just for that reason you should subscribe turn notifications on and drop a like it was, yeah, it definitely took me a good few hours in time. Look at that. There you go. There's another one. That easy. So you can see what hook and what bait I caught it on. There's two different types of baits. You can use the fresh water prawns or the uh, the other ones worked. Where was it? Uh, where, 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 where? There you go. This one as well. So... Yeah, two different baits you can catch it on. You could probably catch it on fresh water prawns as well. I didn't try that though. So anyway, that is exploration complete. So we started off down here and then we moved up to there. Now sometimes when you're doing these exploration missions, you do have to move around. That's just the way it is. So we move up to here and then when you go to there, you go to start fishing and you will be over there where that guy is just there. So I'm going to quickly walk around there just for a second just so you can see where you spawn in so you will spawn in around about here and then you just head over there to where those lily pads are and that will work out perfect and look how quick i caught them as well one after the other that fast but it took me a while to find it that's the only problem <laughs> all right let's quickly reel this one in keep an eye out for exploration 2 because that is going to be coming very very soon as well 
There we go. Okay, so let's have a look really quick. I think there is exploration too. Isn't there? Yeah, okay, so exploration too. Keep an eye out for that. Now we have already just caught that fish, but I will catch it again. And then we're going to catch all these fish here as well. So, hope you guys did enjoy this one. We catch you people again soon with some more fun and games. I'm out. Yeah, cast just around near these lily pads just here. I just want to throw that in just to make it very, very clear. All around here. Seems like around this bit here seems to be best. Anywhere around there is absolutely perfect. There we go. Even that would be fine.